This class we work out on problem on symmetrical fault calculation using Tavern's theorem. This is the given network. This network consists of two generators, two transformers and one transmission line. Two generators are identical. It is star connected, rating is 15 MB and 11 KV. Subtransient reactance is J.15 per unit. This generator is 15 MBA 11 KV. Subtransient reactance is J.15 per unit star connector. Two transformers. Transformer 1 is step up transformer 11 KV bar 66 KV. Rating is 5 MBA. Reactance of the transformer is J.04 per unit. This transformer is step down transformer 66 per 11 KV. Rating is 5 MBA. Reactance of the transformer is J.04 per unit. The length of the transmission line is 50 km. The reactance of the line is 0.95 ohm per km. The question is, if a fault occurs at the midpoint of the line, that is 25 km, calculate the per unit fault current and the actual fault current. That is the question. First step, we choose base MEA, base KV. Base MEA is equal to 50. Base KV is equal to 11. Next, we have to calculate the per unit reactance values of all the components with respect to this base MEA and base KV. Number 1 is a generator. Given the reactance value is J.15, 11 by 11 the whole square into 15 by 15, that is equal to J.15 per unit. Number 2 is a transformer. This is a low voltage side. The given value is J.04 into 11 by 11 the whole square into 15 base divided by rate at 5. That is equal to J.12 per unit. The next step we have to calculate the high voltage KV base. High voltage KV base is equal to low voltage KV base. That is 11 into HT by LT. HT is 66, LT is 11. 11 into 66 by 11. That is equal to 66 KV. That is the transmission voltage. The third is a transmission line. Transmission line reactance is given 0.95 ohm per kilometer. We have to calculate up to 25 kilometers. 25 into J.95 into base MEA 15 divided by transmission voltage that is high voltage 66 square that is equal to J.08 per unit. Fourth is a transformer given value is J.04. This is 66 by 66 the whole square into 15 by 5 that is equal to J.12 per unit. Next we have to calculate the low voltage KV base. Low voltage KV base is equal to high voltage KV base into LT by HT that is equal to 66 into 11 by 66 that is 11 KV. This is 11 KV. Fifth is a generator given is J.15 per unit reactance. 11 by 11 the whole square into 15 by 15 that is equal to J.15 per unit. Second step, I have to draw the reactance diagram. This is the reactance diagram of this network. The pre-fault voltage is 1 angle 0. The pre-fault voltage is 1 angle 0. In previous lectures, I wrongly mentioned the post-fault voltage. I am very sorry. This is pre-fault voltage is 1 angle 0. This is 1 angle 0. The reactance of the generator is J.15. The reactance of the transformer is J.12. The whole reactance is J.15. That is... 50 into 0.95 into 15 by 66 square that is equal to 0.16 per unit therefore this is for 25 kilometers j.08 this is for 25 kilometers j.08 this is a transformer j.12 this is a generator j.15 next step i draw the tevran sequence circuit that is the third step this is the tevran sequence circuit i marked all the values all the values are in per unit here the fault occur at this point. Now I simplify the circuit. These three are in series. These three are in series. This is J.35. This is J.35. Again these two are connected in parallel. J.35 into J.35 divided by J.35 plus J.35. That is equal to J.175. This is 1 angle 0. Pre-fault voltage is 1 angle 0. This is J.175. I can easily calculate the fault current. Fault current is equal to E Thevenance divided by X Thevenance. 
that is equal to 1 angle 0 divided by j.175 that is equal to 5.71 angle minus 90 degree in per unit. So fault current in per unit is 5.71 angle minus 90 degree. Next I have to calculate the base current. Base current is equal to base MEA 15 divided by root 3 into 11 base KV 11 into 1000 that is equal to 787.30 amps. Now I can easily calculate the actual fault current. Per unit value is equal to actual by base. I know per unit value and I know the base value. I can easily calculate the actual fault current. IA is equal to fault current into base current. That is 5.71 into 787.30. Actual fault current is 4495.48 amps. Thanks for listening.